better. Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a 2019 January favorites video. I wanted to bring back the favorites video, so if you guys like this style of video, definitely let me know so I can do it throughout the year. So I have lifestyle, fitness, music, and technology that I'm gonna be sharing with you guys. I'm gonna start with lifestyle. So first things first is the intellectual devotional. I've talked about this before on my channel. You read a page every single day. There's 365 different lessons in this book. I love learning. I love like working out my brain a little bit. Your brain is a muscle and if you stop learning, I feel like you just die slowly. I've heard that before, don't think I'm crazy. Learning is really important to keep your mind active. My mom got this for me for Christmas this year and it's just really nice because it's super easy but you can also get your knowledge in every day. The layout for the book is every Monday you have a history lesson, Tuesdays are literature, Wednesdays are visual arts, Thursdays are science, Fridays are music, Saturdays are philosophy, which is my favorite, and Sundays is religion. You read through one page, and then the next day you have the next lesson and the next day you have the next lesson it's just so easy this is something i incorporated into my morning routine and it's something i really really value and i feel like everyone can learn from so yeah that's my first favorite i will leave every single thing that i mention in the description box down below if you guys want to get them just throwing that out there so i don't have to say in every single product link down below so the next favorite is my espresso machine. I'm pretty sure this one's called the Mueller espresso machine. And again, I got this for Christmas. Nespresso is really, really big right now, but it is super expensive. And this is like a cheap version of it. The same thing, basically. You can put the Nespresso cups into the espresso machine. I actually found this product through my friend. We were going out one night and he's like, do you guys want a shot of espresso? And he like made it with his little espresso machine and told me the price and I was like hooked. I'm pretty sure it's like $60 or something and like super affordable. I'm pretty sure it's like half the price of the Nespresso but you guys can make yourself espresso shots and it's just really fun because I've been making like lattes I'll put like my milk in my foamer and then I'll like mix it with the espresso and it's literally a latte that I'm making and it's just so fun the third lifestyle favorite is my bathroom caddy so this is life changing it's a game changer guys I love baths I don't know about you it's either hit or miss. Either you love baths or you really despise them and you would never be in a bathtub. <laughs> I love reading in the bathtub. I think it's really like relaxing to me. I actually teamed up with Umbra for a video and they gifted this to me. This is definitely something that I would have gotten on my own if I had known about it. But basically you put it in your bathtub like this and these little side pieces go out so it doesn't like fit only a certain bathtub. Like you can fit it to like pretty much any bathtub. And then you put this up and what I do is I bring my laptop on it or I'll bring like a book and kind of place it here and read through it. And then they have like a little section here where you can put like your soap or like a drink or something. And then this is for your wine glass. So you put it in here so it won't spill. There's like a little slot that you slide it in. And then there's like three little things here which you can hang your razor, your sponge that you clean yourself with. Um, I don't know, it's just amazing. I ended up getting this for my mom um, because she likes baths too, so that is literally game changing. The next lifestyle product that I have are my sun and moon earrings i got these from boohoo i'm pretty sure they're like six or nine dollars like they're super super cheap but they're so pretty they're like gold the universe the sun and the moon look what they look like on they really just make anything pop i love them they're so cute actually i'm just gonna wear them the rest of the video take off my hoops they really just make the look and the fact that they're only like six dollars that's crazy there we go look changed all right so the next thing candles you cannot forget candles i went to bath and body works after their end of the year sale so these are like the newer candles that they have the first one that i picked up is midnight blue citrus this container is like one of my favorites i've ever seen i love the like orange colored top here with the dark blue it reminds me of my aunt's house that i grew up in she always had like this like orangey bluish colors in her house not only that, it smells delicious. So this one is Juicy Citrus Fresh Spring Water and Sweet Mango. So it is a sweeter smell. I'm really into citrus smells. Anything citrus, I'm in. That's my favorite essential oil is uh, sweet orange. Then I also picked up the Mahogany Coconut. This one's like a marble case. I've had the Mahogany Coconut before 
and it just smells really summery. It smells like sunscreen and the beach. It just smells really good. This one's creamy coconut, mahogany woods, English lavender, and this one's made with essential oils. So those are the two candles that I picked up from Bath and Body Works. On to fitness. These pants from Lululemon, the Align pants, are the most form-flattering leggings I've ever had in my life. They're so comfortable. I can wear them for anywhere, anytime, any place, honestly. One of the things on my bucket list this year was to invest in a good pair of Lululemon leggings. The alignment pants are their most popular, I think. Like, that's the one that I see everyone wearing. They're high-waisted, they're very slimming. Literally the most comfortable pants I've ever worn in my life. I always buy leggings, but they end up ripping. You know, if you're in yoga, you can literally see through the leggings. Like, it's just not fun. So investing in a good pair of leggings, like I know I'll have these forever, so they're totally worth it. I've worn these non-stop since I've gotten them. Ugh, I can't say enough good things about these leggings. I know it's weird, I know it's like, crazy but trust me if you go try them on and a lululemon's next to you like you'll understand what i'm saying they give you like the feeling of being naked like you're honestly wearing nothing like they're that comfortable and the fact that they make your body look amazing is just a plus speaking of lululemon something else i got for christmas was my lululemon yoga mat so my yoga mat before this was super super thin i'm pretty sure it was like the one that starts with a g that you get at like Target, GM or something like that. It was like ripping and it's like the third yoga mat that I've had and I have like a super bony body. Like my elbows are super bony, my hips are bony, my knees are bony. Using that mat that was like super, super thin was just so uncomfortable. And when I took it to like hot yoga, I would like slip and slide. So this one is so thick. So it's like perfect for my boniness. It doesn't slip. So like when I'm in hot yoga, like I have so much traction when I'm using the mat. Again, an investment but it's totally worth it if you go to like yoga or if you do strength training and your knees are like literally killing you. The third fitness favorite is oh, my pull-up bar. I got this for Christmas too. Everything is, this is like a what I got for Christmas video. My brother got this for me. It is so easy. We've had this in our house like since I was like a kid. So I used to just like hop on the pull-up bar and do pull-ups real quick. It's really nice because you can just literally pop it over your door. It's so easy to take off. There's no drilling. There's no nails or any of that stuff. And when you're walking through your door are reminded, oh, just do a couple pull-ups. And when I first got this, I couldn't even do a pull-up and now I can do three and that's amazing for me <laughs> you can do pull-ups like this you could do pull-ups like this you could do pull-ups on these right here like it's just so easy and just having it so conveniently located right at your door and you can just take it off like if you have guests and you don't want it you know to be an issue i don't know i like to close my door at night so i'll take it off at night to close my bedroom door and i don't have to worry about like it ruining the walls or anything like that it's just nice to have and nice just kind of like pop in real quick and do a few pull-ups. As for music, so if you guys have heard of Billie Eilish, wow. Like if not, go listen to her music. I love music, but I get really, really bored of music really quickly. So if I find a song that I like and I play it like a few times, I'll get like super bored of it. I still have not gotten bored of Billie Eilish. Thanksgiving, my cousin was playing Ocean Eyes and I was like, who is this? This is really good and then i started listening to her other music i was like this is really good and then i kind of just like stopped but then somehow i ran across her again i think it was like a youtube video that i found she was just so interesting to me and i listened to her music again and it just like it just hit me all of her lyrics i don't again that's another thing i don't really listen to lyrics but her lyrics are just so intense they're like so poetically put together they can connect and reside with anyone. Her music is like art, honestly. Her music videos are insane. The lyrics are insane. She is so interesting as a person. The thing about it is she's like only 17. And half the songs that she wrote, she wrote when she was like 13 or 14. It's crazy the fact that she's already at this level at that age. Obviously I listened to Ocean Eyes. That's like a really popular one. And then Lovely with Khalid is really good. They're just so pretty. Oh my god, I can't. I really like I Don't Want to Be You Anymore. I really like Hostage, Bellyache, When the Party's Over, 
Like, ugh, her music, I can't. Go listen to Billie Eilish. If you do anything after this video, I recommend to go listen to her. Okay, so as for technology, number one technology that I have been obsessed with is my Fitbit. I have the band, the charcoal band Fitbit. This tracks your sleep, tracks your steps, tracks your heart rate, tracks your food if you want to. I don't plug in my food. Just a whole bunch of tracking and it's really interesting. Um, it shows you your active hours based on like your heart rate. It tells you how much REM sleep you got, how much light sleep, deep sleep, all this stuff. Like it's just really interesting and it helps me track my like activity i guess you would say so if i'm like so consumed with like a video if i'm editing or something it'll remind me to like go walk 250 steps for this hour it's just really good to keep up with your fitness um your fitness goals and all of that it's something i really 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 love i can't even tell you how much this has helped me this year for fitness and fitness tracking and this isn't really technology i mean i guess but um a netflix show that i really really liked was you i don't really like that many shows um it takes a lot for me to get like hooked on a show and be able to even watch it without like having something distracting me like going through my phone or my emails or anything like that you did it for me i really liked that show and it has the guy from gossip girl in it what is his name penn bagley um and then shay mitchell's in it if you guys like shay mitchell from pretty little liars and then as always grace and frankie if you guys haven't watched that show either it's so cute it's like such a feel-good show like everything is so aesthetically pleasing in that show um jane fonda and lily tomlin jane fonda is 81 years old and lily tomlin is 76 or 75 like the fact that they're still working the fact that they look this good and the fact that they're like still this funny is so crazy to me and i'm such an old soul so that show is like adorably cute and honestly one of my favorite shows i've ever watched um so if you guys are looking for some good shows you is more dark like thriller teenager style and grace and frankie is just more of like a sitcom cute really funny um show that is it for my favorites video i hope you guys enjoyed it again i will leave all of the products and everything that i mentioned in the description box Thank you so much for supporting this channel and watching the video. Let me know if you guys like it. I'll do one for February as well. And I will see you guys all in a future video. Bye guys. Bye.